Hi guys, this is designerglasses.co.uk um, This is a short video on how to order your designer glasses or designer sunglasses online with us. Um, primarily we're using an Android uh, mobile device here. This is a Note 3 I'm using, but it will be very similar in ordering process to an Apple iPhone or a Windows device. Right, we'll start by going to the Designer Glasses home page. So that pops up quite quick. Now there's different ways to search. One is to go to the search bar here, enter the model number or the brand that you may be looking for and do a search there. Or you can scroll up and then you have different filters to order as you wish. Um, you can choose designer glasses, so the optical glasses only, and then choose a brand with that if you know what brand you want to browse. Um, you can choose by price range, you can choose by material, shape, gender, style, everything it says there. Also, we have an option where we have bars where you can, uh, if you want a particular size of frame, you can choose like the eye size and the bridge size and then apply the filter and those sizes will come up as well. That's quite useful if you know the size of frame you want exactly and I'm not too concerned about the model as such. But most people know generally what model they want so they'll go to the search bar and then they will enter the number in. Okay if we start with a number that's already here say for example I'll click on 3003 then we'll do a search for that okay then once you've uh, done that search and scroll up oh, let's go back down let's do that search again sorry it's a loading first and then once it's loaded sorry you scroll up and the frame is here now there's three results found for 3003 and the reason for that is uh, there's three companies that are using that model number so you've got LA Mickley you've got Emporio Armani and you have Stark as well. If you had, say for example, put in the SH3003, then you would have only had this model pop up, um, the one result. Okay, we'll choose the Stark for the demonstration. Okay, so you go to the Stark landing page for that model, 3003, and what you'll see is uh, it tells you a little bit about the frame, the size, the color, uh, gender etc. It'll tell you the price in this case you're around £16. Um, you'll find in store something like this would be probably in the region of about £60 to £70 as a minimum um, but the big difference here is unlike in store you get free lenses included in this price so that's going to save you about £100 on anti-glare and anti-scratch resistant uh, lenses. So our lenses come included in this price if you scroll down further, you'll have the choose choice of an option of colour. You can either choose the colour by the actual name or the code itself. So a blue is a triple zero two. If we choose the blue and then scroll down, the next step that appears is the choice of frame only or frame with lenses. If we choose frame only, the next box is your eye size and bridge. This frame only comes into one eye size and bridge, so choose that. And then it'll go straight to your Atoma basket because you're not choosing lenses, uh, you're not applying anything else, it's the frame only you're ordering, and that's it. If I clear that selection and go to frame with lenses, choose the eye size again. Now you'll see you've got a choice of what you use the glasses for because we're going to be applying lenses. So if you're using primarily for distance, like for television or driving, reading or computer, or everyday use, you wear them all the time. Okay, if we click everyday use here, the next pop-up page is your type of lens. You have the choice of single vision, bifocal, or very focals. You have three very focals from your standard to your premium. Um, the price goes up depending on the quality of the very focal you go for. If we choose, in this case, a single vision lens, the next pop-up page is lens material. 
Now your standard lens material is 1.5 going up to 1.6 and 167, 174. These numbers refer to refractive index, which means the lens is going to be thinner and lighter the bigger the number. Okay, but a standard lens is quite suitable for lower powers or standard powers. So unless you have a very high prescription or a moderate high prescription, or you're looking to have the thinnest and lightest lens possible, you know, you can go for the other options. The most common lens most people go for is the 1.6 lens, even for light to moderate prescriptions, because it just makes the, the glasses appear nicer as well with a flatter, thinner lens. So if we choose, uh, in this case, we'll choose a standard option. Okay, so there's no charge on there. Now, you get the option of coatings on the lens. As I said, a scratch-resistant anti-glare coating comes free of charge. Okay, some people, for some reason, you know, don't want the coating on it at all. They just want a basic lens, and again, that's free, but, the, you know, that should be requested. Otherwise, you will get the scratch-resistant anti-glare lens because that's visually better for your lens and more protective for the lens surface. Now, the Grisel Alaze and the Grisel Forte, they're superior coatings. Obviously, the more you pay, the better coating you get because technology has moved on. Grisel Forte is very similar in toughness to glass. Okay, if we were to choose the Grisel Forte in this case, the next option then comes up is if you want a tint or a sunglass type effect on your uh, lenses. So if you choose none, then it'll be clear, perfectly clear lenses. Then you can choose obviously your tints, and the tints will have options of how dark you want them once you choose those. Then you have transition lenses. These are the ones that change colour, so they go from light to dark, depending on the amount of sun there is. Um, then you have a mirror tint, um, you know, that, that's good for fashion. Then you have a polarised tint, uh, good for sports, especially like uh, golf, uh, fishing, um, even cycling as well, actually. And a polarised tint is also very good for driving as it gets rid of glare, lots of glare. All right, we'll, we'll choose, we don't want a tint, we just want a clear lens. Then the next pop-up box is your prescription. So this will be what you'll have from your optician. It should be less than two years old uh, for it to be used. Okay, so in your prescription, your right sphere, you'll have the options of going from a plus six all the way to a minus eight. But over a minus six, there is uh, a charge of 20 pound because the lens has to be specially surfaced to go over that power. So a plus six to a minus six, there's no extra charge. Okay, I'm going to choose a moderate prescription. Low moderate, minus one. Um, cylinder, if you have some astigmatism, again, plus three, that'll go to a minus three. We'll choose a minus one and the axis of the cylinder. You go from zero all the way to 180 in half degree steps. All right, I'll choose for the sake of this prescription, I'll choose three. Then you do the same with your left eye. Put the prescription your optometrist has put in. Let's choose minus 075. Left cylinder is minus 050. Make sure you put in the right um, abbreviation before minus or a plus what the optician has written in. Okay, left axis is, in this case, two degrees we'll put. All right. After this, you'll choose an ad. Now, the ad may not be on your prescription. This is primarily if you have a bifocal or a varifocal. It'll go from zero to plus 350. Um, if you have a bifocal or varifocal and you have an ad click, we'll click two here in this case. Uh, please do put it in your prescription. Okay. All right, the PD is the distance between your eyes. So the lenses are centered accordingly to the PD. Now the default PD is set at 63. If you click the information box, it'll tell you that 63 is your default PD if you don't know what it is. Most of the population falls very near or if not exactly on that PD. But for very focal and bifocals or high prescriptions, it is good to have your exact PD. And you can choose that PD by going from here, 50 all the way up to quite a large 90. Um, but your average PD, as I say, is default of 63. Alright, so that's your prescription put in, that's your frame chosen, that's your coatings chosen, your lens type chosen, you add that to your basket. You should go to the page now where it gives you a summary of what you've ordered. So you have the frame, the 303, 3003, 
Uh, it gives you a picture again to remind you to make sure you've ordered the right one. Uh, the quantity of it, uh, you've got the reminder of the colour it is, you've got the eye size, lens type. And if you remember, we chose the Crizel Forte coating, which is £35. Now, the total price here is 250 so that was the price of the frame, which was 215 plus the 35 so the total appears here. And then, once you've uh, verified what you've put in, you go to checkout. And then you come to the payment page, okay? You put your billing address in. And if you do have a voucher, um, vouchers are sometimes available on our website or the internet depending on some promotions we may be doing something like Father's Day or Christmas um, Mother's Day maybe um, you know put the voucher code in and you know you, you may get a, uh, a further discount okay ship to billing address and your order is confirmed again and then you choose your payment method either pay by world pay which is obviously a secure method of credit card or debit card payment or you can choose to pay by PayPal as well actually um, but this has to be filled in for you to get to that stage so hopefully this uh, little tutorial has helped you um, choose your glasses with us and you'll go ahead and do that um, there is a guarantee on the glasses manufacturer's guarantee of one year and if you have any other kind of issues or problems you can always call us on our free phone number which is 0800 731 8118 and we'd be more than happy to talk to you uh, we do have experienced staff always on our hand in the practice to give you a hand any, with any questions you have. Alright, thank you and goodbye.